Hey guys, how's it going? Tess back again with another episode of the Sticker Book Collection. Now, this first episode, the first episode went down phenomenally well. Honestly, I cannot thank you guys enough for the way that that video was received. Over 320 likes as I record this. Unbelievable. If you could hit like on this one as well, then that'd be absolutely amazing. Even if this video does half as well as that first one went down, that'd be absolutely superb. Now, I went out and I bought five packs this time. It would be a larger pack opening. Because, of course, we only had the two last time because that was all I bought just as a test thing. But we'll open five today. And actually, in the comments section of the previous video, there were a few of you saying um, that you either you know can't afford to get the packs, etc. Or that it's not available in your country. Now, I'm going to leave a link in the description. It actually takes you to the FIFA official website. Uh, FIFA as in actual FIFA rather than EA Sports FIFA. Actual, actual FIFA FIFA. You can actually do it online. You can collect the stickers online. You get three free packs every single day and you can do quizzes and stuff to unlock additional packs and you can uh, you know trade online with other people that have opened their packs and got duplicates etc so if you do uh, want to do that I'll leave a link in the description for those of you that can't necessarily get hold of the book whether it's not available in uh, in your country or whether you know you just can't afford to keep buying the packs etc because it soon adds up you know to fill the whole book it's going to cost a fair whack and uh, you I've seen people go out and spend you know 50 to 100 pounds on the big boxes you know that the convenience stores get these in people have been buying them wholesale but let's jump straight into the packs then whilst we uh, get going with this one but yeah I'll leave a link in the uh, in the description to uh, to that FIFA website that link so you can even if you can't do the actual sticker book itself you can still you know be involved etc open your own uh, open your own packs when well, I will pull these out actually if I I'm just going to check the back of these because right none of these have actually got one on but if you do are opening the stickers and you still want to do online as well some of the stickers on the back will have a code in on this side and if you enter that code on that FIFA website you get an additional free pack as well so uh, it kind of it goes hand in hand with uh, I guess it's just kind of an extra incentive for people to buy the actual packs rather than just use the free one online but let's get going then with this one and the first player we pull is Marcos Rojo as you can see the Argentinian defender so that's definitely one that we haven't got already we pulled a uh, an Argentinian player in uh, the opening couple of packs that we opened, so we're doing well there. We get a Greek player, Kostas Manolas. I'm not too sure whether he's a goalkeeper or uh, an actual player. Uh, he plays for Olympiakos. I, uh, I honestly, I honestly don't know. So uh, this is going to kind of be a uh, an interesting journey to find out some new stuff about IRL players for me as well as you guys. But we get Charles Itanje from uh, from Cameroon. There, I'm not sure where what position he plays, but he plays for Konya Sport in the Turkish league. Next card is actually Miguel Layun from uh, Club America. He's Mexican, as you might be able to uh, tell from the club that he plays for, etc. And we get Paul Pogba. That's probably the uh, the best player from that pack. Paul Pogba playing for Juventus for France in uh, in Serie A, of course. Now, Paul Pogba is probably going to be part of France's starting lineup. You would have thought for the World Cup tournament itself. But uh, let's crack open this next pack and see what we get in here. Bosch, shove that down there. See if any of these got a code on that one. There you go, that's the code, just as the example. That's the code that you can then go and enter online. I will have already entered this online, so you know, don't don't try and use this code. But uh, they're the, the stickers that you see, it's different from the rest. Oh, we've got two in the one pack, that's quite cool. So I will go and enter those online and add to my personal online uh, sticker collection. But it's actually the uh, the Dutch uh, national football badge there, it's the shiny, it's our second shiny. We of course got the uh, the England uh, flag earlier on. We actually get the Uruguay squad as well as the sticker. There's the whole team there, starting eleven. You got uh, Cavani and uh, Luis Suarez in there, as well as Diego Lugano, etc. So uh, that's nice to have. That's an extra one. What, the first type of those that we've got, and actually the first type of the national team badges we got. We got half of one of the stadiums as well. Fortaleza, so Fortaleza. That's half of one of the uh, the stadiums that will go in quite nicely. We've also got Socrates Papastopoulos. He, of course, plays for uh, Borussia Dortmund in the uh, in the Bundesliga. German, cent not German, but uh, Greek centre-back playing in Germany. And the uh, the host, the Brazil national football team badge, another shiny. That's our third shiny, so still no duplicates as well out of the, uh, the four packs total that we've opened so far in the series. Uh, if this video goes down as well as the others have, I will do this on a more consistent basis. Now, of course, I already double upload on a Tuesday and a Thursday with the My Player. So if this does just as well, you'll be seeing this on Wednesday. There will have been a AC Milan career mode video uploaded on earlier on this afternoon. It'll be a Juventus 
uh, the actual live cup final come from the Copa Nacional. It's a live com for the cup final. That's the last uh, video of actual gameplay from the opening season at AC Milan. There will be a, um, a season roundup video coming for you tomorrow, and then we'll start the new season on Friday. But if, like I say, if this series starts to go down really, really well, then I will double upload on a Monday, a Wednesday, and a Friday, and you'll have this as your extra upload on a Monday night, a Wednesday night, and a Thursday, uh, Friday night, sorry. And then perhaps I'll do it on a Saturday evening as well. And then on a Sunday, we can maybe, just as a roundup, go through the book and, you know, kind of catch up on our progress so far and see what players we've been able to pull in that particular week. But uh, the first player we pull here in this third pack is actually Michael Essien. Of course, plays for AC Milan now, not Chelsea, Ghanaian centre mid. We've got another code to use online. It's actually the, uh, the as you can see... Oh, Get it in the camera shot. As you can see, it's actually the uh, the official logo for Panini. Is that number one? It's number zero zero, in fact. So, uh, the f literally the first car or first sticker that you can actually get. The next player, Robin van Persie. That's a nice pull. So we've got Michael Essien, Paul Pogba, and Robin van Persie so far. The biggest players that we've pulled today. The next card is uh, Gotuku Sakai, obviously playing for Japan, plays for VFP Stuttgart in the Bundesliga. And the final card is Aribe Peralta, obviously a striker as well, I think, playing for uh, plays for Santos Laguna in the uh, in the Mexican League, Liga MX, I think it's called. Do you, excuse me, I'm just going to have a quick swig of water. Right, let's crack on then with pack number four. That's some decent pulls so far, Robin Van Persie in that one, and Mike Lessian to go along with Paul Pogba. I've got quite a few codes as well there for me to add on to my... Uh, it's my online one. You can actually register on on the FIFA website and actually, uh, you know, tweet out and or li you know link it with your Facebook, etc. So you can let your friends know how you're getting on. But let's see who we get get in the first one here. It is is it Harovic, perhaps? Not too sure how to pronounce it. Again, I'm sorry that it doesn't focus quite so well as it perhaps could do. That's just the the iPhone. I'm only recording it on an iPhone, so it's not the the best of quality, but. I'm not necessarily going to go out and buy a fancy camera just to uh, open sticker book packs, but David Pizarro is the next player that we get, playing for Fiorentina in the Serie A. He's Chilean, one of the more experienced Chilean players in uh, in their squad. And then we pull Dario Serna, very good right-back, plays for Shakhtar Donetsk in the Ukrainian League, Croatian, of course. And then the next players, Michael Bradley, recently moved to FC Toronto from AS Roma, of course, one of the... Uh, the leading line stars in the US men's national team. And the final player is Tony Cruz, a very, very good German player. So we've been pulling some really nice players in these packs so far. We haven't, as of yet, had any duplicates, which is a bit of a godsend, because I know a lot of people have been having trouble pulling uh, you know, the same cards again and again and again. So, uh, so far, touch wood, we haven't pulled any duplicates. 539, who are you? This is Kevin Prince Boateng, another very, very good uh, signing. I guess signing is the, the way to, to say it. Kevin Prince Boateng plays for Schalke in the Bundesliga, of course. Very, very good midfielder. Then we get Lerim Zamali. I'm not really too sure whether I'm pronouncing that right. But uh, he plays for Napoli in, in Serie A. He's a Swiss player. I'm not too sure what position he plays. We get Kevin Strootman, of course, also playing in Serie A. Plays for, uh, for Roma. Nice midfielder to get there. And the next pull is Thibaut Courtois, of course, the Chelsea goalkeeper on loan at Atletico Madrid. And we will be playing against him in the Champions League semi-final. UEFA have stepped in and uh, kind of nullified the contract between the two clubs, saying that uh, you know he won't be able to play should the two draw each other. And he will be playing in that Champions League semi-final. And then the final player from the final pack is Seniad Ibricic, playing for, uh, for Bosnia-Herzegovina. is actually the first Bosnian player that we've pulled. So that's going to bring this episode to a close, guys. Please do feel free to leave the video a like, if you could be so kind. Let me know in the comment section down below if you'll actually take advantage of the uh, the online sticker book, because, of course, that is something that you guys from uh, you know other countries that don't necessarily have the, the, uh, the Panini books in, uh, in your shops, etc. But let me know in the comment section if you're going to take advantage of that. I am definitely going to uh, to be using it. And I'll be tweeting out, etc., letting you know how I'm getting on. So feel free to follow me on Twitter as well, at Chesnoid Gaming. There'll be a link to that in the description, as well as a link to the online version of the sticker book. And, of course, a link to subscribe as well if you want to see more of this, more my player and career mode stuff then feel free to uh, subscribe to my channel, Chesnoy Gaming, as well. There'll be a link in the description to do that. But that's going to bring this one to a close, guys. This one actually is a little bit longer than all the the previous, the, uh, the earlier one. If you missed the uh, first video, there'll be a link as an annotation in the bottom left-hand side of your screen here uh, if you missed that video. But that's going to bring this one to a close, guys. It's almost 10 minutes now, so thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.